powwows and round dances are being cancelled. But in the homes of many Indigenous families, the celebration of culture and tradition must go on. Our round dance season is usually winding up now and then you have some really big celebrations for that, but everything's cancelled and I think it, it kind of um, it kind of dampened a bunch of people's spirits. And that's usually what we turn to as Indigenous people, you know, to uplift ourselves and bring that, that prayer. And we gather and we sing and we dance and we practice culture, you know, and and we're not able to do that right now for health and safety reasons, so. Fawn Wood and her partner Dallas Waskahat are isolating at home in St. Paul, Alberta, but keeping busy by hosting a virtual round dance and powwow. It's caught the attention of hundreds and connecting people from all corners of Turtle Island. Social media groups like Social Distancing Pow Wow have also been created for sharing music and dance. Social distancing, but I'm just kind of managing our kids too at the same time and trying to, you know, <laughs> yeah, see, to that's, quiet that's, them down. that's the reality yeah. of our like we're able to put on the show for everybody every day, but at the same time, we've been quarantined in our house yeah. with our three kids yeah. for 14 days while trying to do all yeah. this too. So it's been fun. <laughs> And it's a process. The gatherings are daily, and for this couple, the days start off with contacting performers, hosts, and creating lineups. We have people saying that their whole family will gather, like in the living room, to watch yeah. this, and they look forward to it. Uh, people are like, oh, we always make sure we charge our phones or we get our chores done before we start. Wood says while social media and electronics often distance family members, it's what's bringing all nations together during the time it's needed the most. Tamara Pimentel, APTN National News, Calgary.